<sighs> so, I think you know the reason why you clicked on this video, right? The question is, what's wrong with dating nowadays? Well, I'm gonna show you these five things why dating is just rigged nowadays, really. So let me show you right quick. Let me go ahead and get ready for you guys. And make sure you enjoy this video and smash that like button. So let's get started with the first one. Rule number one, the hookups. Now, gentlemen, ladies, don't take it way too far and too personal, but I know how we all like to play others and act like they like us or act like we like them. So I'm gonna tell you this right now. It's 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 not it's not healthy if you're trying to really date or trying to get in an actual relationship. And hookups is this sort of thing that you 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 kind of you kind of be like oh my god is he really gonna like me oh my god i think i really like her or oh my god i think i'm just gonna act like i like him but then i'm gonna dump him afterwards probably the next few days something like that just be with somebody else see i'm just telling you guys my opinion because i've been with um i've been with girls like that before that does a lot of hookups and stuff like that and they try to get me sometimes over my body and not really my actual personality or what's in my heart. So I'm just telling you guys that, but a lot of people do that nowadays and they think it's fun, which is not really fun, really. It's not really fun. I wouldn't be making this video for you guys just to help you guys out. And I wouldn't be saying anything because I like to keep things to myself, which is kind of personal. But you know, some things need to be said sometimes, you know, I just, I do this for a reason. I feel like I want to come out and do this today which I need to do it because I'm gonna tell you what the other four reasons why dating nowadays is just wrong and rigged. So, on to the next one. Number two, playing you. Now, you might seem like this is crazy, but half of the time, some of these people in the world, they be playing you just to get something out of you or just to get to somebody else, of course. Like me, say for instance, somebody, uh, a girl has done this to me before. She's played me multiple times and I let her in, I kept, I kept letting her in, kept letting her in. And then, boom, I just, I was like, you know what, forget it, I'm done. I learned my lesson. And that's how it's settled. Cause uh, guys, you don't you don't want a female to be playing you nowadays, because it's just gonna create this frustration and anger and all this anxiety that comes in. All all this, it just, it just comes from thinking about that one girl, and the girl just goes for you too. And thinking about that one guy, if he doesn't text back or if he doesn't come around, forget it. Move on. You need to learn how to move on with your life and learn how to respect others. I know you're thinking, why you got the air conditioning in the car? Well, I'm gonna tell you right now, it is very, very hot in this state down here and it's like 92 degrees, I think. I have no idea. I need some water, I need some ice on me, bro. I need all that. But as I was saying, don't don't always, always just put yourself in that position where, oh, I don't think I'm gonna be with this person forever or I think I'm gonna be with that person forever. It's, it's not gonna work. And to know that, like very, very quick, just like talk to the person in general. Now, let's move on to number three.
think you all might like number three. It's rigged. Now you might be thinking in general, why is it so rigged? Why is dating so rigged nowadays? Well, no one's not really there to actually really comfort you or to talk to you or, you know, just want to hang out with you. And everybody be like, it's kind of like everybody wants to be on their own grind. Like people want to do things, you know, probably just to break people's hearts and not date them. But dating is, is, is this, in 2019, dating is kind of, uh, it, it's just kind of not, not as what it used to be like two years ago in 2017. 2017 used to be like guys shooting a shot but now guys are kind of getting tired of asking out these women and these women are the ones that kind of is not waiting for someone unexpected but waits for someone that's perfect and not try with these other guys it's like a four out of ten or a three out of ten or a five out of ten or a six out of ten when they're probably a six out of ten five out of ten or four out of ten doesn't matter really but it's rigged. It's very, very rigged. I haven't dated a girl in six years. I've been talking to some people, but they haven't really got me anywhere. So I just decided just just to not date and just focus on myself and just learn how to learn learn how to respect myself even more and just learn how to love myself more. That's all you need to do, really. But hey, I'm at this cliff up here. I'm about to fly the drone for a couple views. You know what I'm saying? So let's already get started. So you might be asking yourself this question, hey, am I ever gonna fall in love one day? Trust me, you're gonna fall in love one day and you might not ever fall in love one day because love nowadays is very different in society and it's very different in like everyone's culture because the love is not really there. Like say for instance, if you force a relationship with one person and it doesn't work out, that that's not love. You know, love is this thing that only comes first in hand and that one specific person that is exactly like you. But there's none of that anymore and that nowadays you see these people uh, being broken up and have these long distance relationships and it kinda doesn't work out for them. And that brings the second thing, affection. There is nothing effective in the world anymore that nobody just doesn't like. Everybody be on their own game. So let's just say you want to take this person out to eat. Be like, oh yeah, we can go this way. We can go to Longhouse Steakhouse or something like that. You know, we can go here. You know, we can go to this crap. Uh, we can go to this crap place or something like that. Um, people are not really affected by that anymore because you know, and people are not really like affected, like affected in dating. Like say if you watch Netflix, like all these TV shows, like Love Don't Cost a Thing or anything else that's love related or it's just like a, a relationship type of movie or, or a show just in general. You know, people's not really in that specific zone anymore because, you know, others are just looking for someone or they're probably just looking for someone that likes to, uh, that likes money or, you know, people other people just use them for specific reasons. So that, my friends, is love and affection. And now you guys can smash that like button, comment below what else videos you want. Now we're gonna move on 
to number five, which is the last thing in this video. But I'm gonna fix me something to eat and hit the gym, but we're gonna do number five before I hit the gym. So let's do it and let's get into it. six pack ab workout but uh let's get straight into number five i'm tired of course number five everybody's on their own grind now you might think that um everyone is different nowadays but i gotta tell you it is it's actually true because you know everyone just doesn't really want to be in the area of a uh, love right now they don't want to have a relationship because they're focusing on their own goals and their own dreams <clears throat> so i say you should do the same thing you know nobody's not around just always focus on yourself and for me i can tell you right now you're not alone but i can tell you right now my story is every time that i tried to x out a girl nobody was really around you know to try to be down for it but anytime when uh, i'm not around and when I'm not looking for anybody, it's always like multiple girls looking up to you and always trying to come towards you. Some of them, I know they're just trying, want to get something else out of me or coming from my body or just trying to use me in general just to get to somebody else, which, hey, I'm not the only one that been in this situation. You guys probably been in this situation as well. So I say, guys, make sure you leave this video a like and comment whatever your problems is down below what happened in the past relationships that you had in the past you know and that's it for today's video uh next music video will be uploaded probably today i don't know but um stay tuned man stay tuned and uh all you have a good day